Ever wondered how some people seem to have it all figured out financially? They're not just lucky, they've mastered the art of financial stability. This isn't about being rich but about understanding and effectively managing your finances. It's about having enough for your basic needs and wants while also preparing for unexpected expenses and your future. Financial stability is like a safety net that keeps you afloat when life throws a curveball. It's the peace of mind that comes from knowing you're not one paycheck away from financial distress. It's the freedom to make choices that allow you to enjoy life today, while also investing in your future. The cornerstone to achieving financial stability is effective money management. This involves budgeting, saving, investing, managing expenses, and making informed financial decisions. But don't worry, it's not as complex as it sounds. Stay tuned as we delve into 10 actionable tips to help you achieve financial stability. Tip number one, create a budget and stick to it. Now let's delve deeper into the importance of budgeting. Imagine your financial journey as a road trip. You wouldn't start driving without a map or GPS, would you? Similarly, a budget serves as your financial roadmap, directing your income towards your expenses, savings, and investments. Creating a budget is simpler than you might think. Start by listing out your income sources, then jot down all your expenses, and I mean all of them, from rent and groceries to your morning coffee. Subtract your total expenses from your total income and voila, that's your budget. This budget will help you understand where your money is going, and more importantly, where you want it to go. It can highlight areas of unnecessary spending, enabling you to redirect those funds towards your financial goals. Remember, a budget is your financial roadmap, guiding you towards financial stability. Moving on to tips 2, 3, and 4. Save for emergencies, pay off high interest debt, and invest in your future. Our second tip is about building an emergency fund. It's a financial buffer that can help you cover unexpected expenses without resorting to credit cards or loans. Aim to save at least three to six months worth of living expenses. This safety net can be a lifeline when life throws a curveball at you, a sudden job loss, an unforeseen medical expense, or any unplanned cost. Establishing an emergency fund may take time, but it's worth the effort. Next, we'll tackle high interest debt. The longer you carry debt, the more you'll end up paying in interest. It's a cycle that can be hard to break free from, so prioritize paying off high-interest debts such as credit card balances. Consider strategies like debt consolidation or balance transfers, which can lower your interest rates and help you pay off your debts faster. Remember, every dollar you're not paying in interest is a dollar you can put towards your savings or investments. Speaking of investments, that brings us to our fourth tip, investing in your future. This might seem daunting at first, especially if you're just starting out with money management. But, investing doesn't have to be complicated. You can start by contributing to a retirement account like a 401k or an IRA. These accounts often come with tax benefits which can make your savings grow even faster. Or consider investing in the stock market. While it does come with risks, it also offers the potential for significant returns over time. The key is to start small and gradually increase your investments as you become more comfortable with the process. In summary, saving for emergencies, paying off high-interest debt, and investing in your future are three powerful strategies that can help you achieve financial stability. Each of these steps requires discipline and patience, but the rewards are well worth the effort. These three tips are fundamental pillars in building a stable financial future. Tip number five, cut unnecessary expenses. Diving into this, it's all about understanding your spending habits. Start by reviewing your credit card statements, bank accounts, and even those cash receipts. We often spend more than we realize on non-essentials like coffee shop lattes, takeout meals, or online subscriptions we barely use. Once you've identified these leaks, it's time to plug them. Consider brewing your coffee at home, cooking more meals, or canceling unused subscriptions. These might seem like small changes, but they can add up significantly over time. For instance, saving just $5 a day adds up to nearly $2,000 a year. And let's not forget about bigger expenses. Are there areas where you might be overpaying, like insurance or utilities? Shop around for better rates or negotiate with your providers. Remember, every dollar saved is a dollar earned. It's not just about cutting costs, but making smarter decisions that improve your overall financial health. Finally, tip 6 to 10. Set financial goals, automate your savings, track your spending, avoid lifestyle inflation, and educate yourself. Embarking on your financial journey without clear goals is like setting sail without a compass. So, tip number six, set financial goals. Whether it's saving for a dream vacation, buying a home, or planning for retirement, 
Having specific, measurable, attainable, relevant, and time-bound goals can steer your financial ship in the right direction. Next up, tip number seven, automate your savings. In today's digital age, it's easier than ever to make saving money a seamless part of your everyday life. Just set up automatic transfers to your savings account and voila, you're saving without even thinking about it. This out-of-sight, out-of-mind approach can make a big difference in growing your nest egg. On to tip number eight, track your spending. By keeping a close eye on where your money is going, you can identify any spending leaks and patch them up. Whether it's that daily latte or impulse online shopping, tracking your spending can help you make necessary adjustments to stay on budget and reach your financial goals faster. Now tip number nine, avoid lifestyle inflation. As your income grows, it can be tempting to upgrade your lifestyle proportionately. But remember, just because you can afford to live more lavishly, doesn't mean you should. Keeping your spending in check, regardless of how much you earn, is crucial for building wealth in the long run. And finally, tip number 10, educate yourself. The world of personal finance can be complex, but don't let that intimidate you. There are countless resources out there from books and podcasts to online courses and blogs that can equip you with the knowledge to make informed financial decisions. So, commit to lifelong learning and empower yourself to take control of your financial future. With these tips, you're well on your way to achieving financial stability. To recap, today's video provided 10 actionable tips to help you achieve financial stability. We discussed the importance of budgeting, saving for emergencies, paying off high interest debt, investing in your future, cutting unnecessary expenses, setting financial goals, automating your savings, tracking your spending, avoiding lifestyle inflation, and educating yourself about personal finance. Remember, achieving financial stability is a journey, not a destination. Keep learning, keep growing, and keep moving towards your financial goals.